Stephen here from Inexterious Painters and Decorators and you're watching Inexterious TV. In this video we're going to be fixing peeling paint. If you would like to purchase some of the similar tools or materials that are used for this task please feel free to check out the links in the description below and also if you're planning on doing any other decorating work please feel free to check out my tool store. The link is also in the description below. So with that said, let's do this. The tools and materials that we use for this task is we've got some Zinzer peel stock, some fine surface filler, some synthetic paint brushes, dust brush, filling knife, cork board, some worn down 80 grit sandpaper, a multi-tool scraper and the wall color. In this case, white emulsion. This is the peeling paint that we're going to be fixing and this is what it looked like after we just got a coat of paint on it. I mean it looks a lot worse there than what it does when it's dry. I mean the paint did peel off the moment that we put the roller over it that's why you can see the bare plaster. Right what we need to do is just scrape it all back to a hard edge. But sometimes you feel like you can't get back to that hard edge or that edge is that little bit precarious. You feel like you can continue to keep scraping. And that's where this um, Zinza pill stop comes in. I mean, some in some cases you can um, scrape stuff back to a hard edge and you don't need to use the Zinza pill stop. But in this case, you just feel that you could continue to keep scraping this and this paint would keep coming. So these edges are a little bit precarious. So this is where the pill stop comes into its own. So after you gave it a good scrape, sand and a dust off, you're ready to apply your first coat of Zinza pill stop. Make sure you paint it all over that bare bit of plaster as well because not only does it stick the edges down, it seals the plaster ready for your coat of paint. And that's what I feel is the cause of this problem, is that the paint wasn't watered down enough, so therefore it hasn't sealed the plaster and the paint is just sitting on top of the plaster. So this is the consequence of when you don't seal your plaster properly with thin down paint. Once your Zinza pill stop is fully dry, you can then get your fine surface filler and just fill those edges just to tidy them up. And remember, always fill cleanly because the cleaner you fill, the easier it is to sand. If you would like to know how to paint new plaster, please feel free to check out the card on the top right hand corner of the screen. Or you can wait till the end of the video where it will pop up on an end screen. Once the filler's dry, get your worn down 80 grit sandpaper and just sand the filler and feather the edges of the filler to blend it in. And then give it another dust off and then it's ready for a couple of coats of paint. And this is it, all done. And that is how you go about fixing peeling paint. If you've got anything from this video, please like, share, subscribe. Please hit that notification bell if you want to be notified of any future videos. And please feel free to leave a comment down below in the comment section. Thank you very much and thanks for watching. Take care.